Hi team, Miss Juan here. Um, today you're going to be working on a couple of things. So the first thing that you're going to do is that you're going to listen to the audiobook of chapter three of Chronicle of a Death Foretold. As you're listening, as a way to keep you engaged in what it is that you're reading and following along too, I want you guys to have post-its out and I want you to be keeping track of all of the really graphic imagery that's being used. And then also keep track of the way that honor is really upheld for the Vicario brothers because chapter two was all about Angela and Bayardo. Chapter three is going to be all about the Vicario brothers and how they felt the need to uphold the family's honor by killing Santiago. Um, there's going to be some weird things that happen throughout this chapter and that's on purpose. Um, it's also supposed to make us really think about if you haven't already, it's supposed to make us think about the credibility of the narrator throughout all of this, um, and whether or not the story is actually believable. And then when you're done, you're going to complete the questions that you have been given. And then after that, you're going to have some time to make up any work that it is that you're missing because a lot of you still haven't turned in your slideshows all the way back to Britney Spears um, and Frozen Assets. And so you can still turn that stuff in. And then you can also turn in the um, symbolic landscape in La Mandragora and then the Rage of the Incel slides too. Um, if you have any questions, please email me. We're going to be powering through the book next week, and you guys are going to get your final essay assignment next week as well. Um, and you're also going to get the beginning outlines of the I.O. So we got lots to do in the next couple of weeks, and I apologize that I'm out for today and tomorrow, but hopefully I'll be back in action by Monday. Okay, be good.